Today I will show you how to use the Auto Escape Special Character option in MQTT Publisher. When a JSON, simple, formatted message is published, it may contain special characters such as backslash, or double quotation mark. These special characters need to be manually escaped, or JSON parsing errors may occur. With, Auto Escape Special Character, option selected. Easy Builder Pro will help escape these special characters in a string by preceding them with a backslash. Hat is, a backslash is written as backslash backslash, and a double quotation mark is written as backslash quotation mark. This tutorial video includes two topics. 1. How to create a topic with auto escape special characters option enabled. 2. Running the program. Let's create a CMTX project. Click, IIoT, Energy, MQTT, on the toolbar to open, MQTT, dialog box. In this tutorial I will make the HMI serve as an MQTT broker. So let's set 127.0.0.1 as the broker IP. Here I will publish two topics. In the first topic, auto escape special character function will be enabled. Let's set the data format to string and the string length to 10 words. The auto escape function is only available when the data to be published is a string. Let's create the second topic. The published content will be the same, but this time I will disable the auto escape function. Let's create an ASCII object to enter the data for publishing. OK, let's download the project to the HMI. Now you can see two windows on the screen. The left one is MQTT.FX which is an MQTT client program. I will use it to connect to the broker on HMI. Let's enter the broker profile for connection. Subscribe the two topics published just now. The first topic is called, Escape. And the second topic is, Noscape. Let's publish something and check if the connection works well. Let's change the decoder to JSON format decoder. OK, now we receive these two topics. When the topic contains a special character like backslash, as you can see, Easy Builder Pro escapes the backslash automatically by preceding it with another backslash. The decoder can't parse the data in the second topic since the auto escape function is not enabled. Let's enter a double quotation mark, which is also a special character. Easy Builder Pro will escape it if the auto escape function is enabled. This is the demo of auto escape special character function for today. Thank you for watching.